Hi, I'm Inga with MostFertileDays.info. In this lesson, I'm going to show you what egg white fertile cervical mucus looks like and how to check for it. This information is vital, especially if you want to know when is the best time to time intercourse for optimizing your chances for pregnancy. Fertile cervical mucus is your key to knowing when are your most fertile days. You see, up to five days before ovulation, your cervix will start producing fertile cervical mucus. Sperm can live in this fertile cervical mucus for days while they wait for the egg to be released on ovulation day. Only intercourse that occurs while you have fertile cervical mucus and on the day of ovulation can potentially result in pregnancy. So what does this fertile cervical mucus look like? This is a great example of fertile cervical mucus. Notice that fertile cervical mucus is clear or opaque in coloring. It might even be streaked with little white flecks. The consistency of it is stretchy, slimy, and super wet. That's why fertile cervical mucus is most often compared to raw egg whites. So how do we check for our cervical mucus? Well, the easiest way I have found to check your cervical mucus is to just insert a clean finger in your vagina while you are squatting. Swipe around and pull out your finger. Check the consistency of the mucus between your fingers. If you didn't get a good sample, especially if it feels really wet in there, try again. I have found that fertile cervical mucus is so slippery that sometimes it will fall off before I pull out my finger. Check your mucus at least once a day. After your shower is a convenient time. Keep track of your findings on a fertility chart. I'd like to take a moment to show you what infertile cervical mucus looks like. You will see this infertile mucus during most of the month. After your period, you might have a few dry days where you're not producing any mucus. But eventually, within a few days, you will start to produce an infertile cervical mucus. This mucus may start off with a filmy consistency or it might even be so dry that it's kind of rubbery or sticky. Eventually though this mucus becomes more wet and it takes on a more creamy or lotiony or milky consistency. The infertile cervical mucus usually has a white coloring. This is different from the fertile cervical mucus which is more clear. And remember, fertile cervical mucus is slimy and stretchy. Infertile cervical mucus is not slimy and it's not stretchy. Your cervical mucus is always on a continuum, changing from one kind into another. This picture is a good example of creamy infertile cervical mucus that's just beginning to become fertile. Notice mixed in the white cream there's a little bit of stretchy stuff. That's the fertile stuff that's starting to appear. Eventually though that white cream will disappear. You won't have any more of that on your finger and all you will be having when you pull out your finger is just this clear, slimy, stretchy, fertile cervical mucus. 
I hope this presentation has been helpful, even empowering to many women who are trying to understand what does their fertile cervical mucus look like and how do I check for it. If you would like more help in learning how to discover your body's fertility signals and would like to learn how to get pregnant naturally, please visit my website, mostfertiledays.info. There you can get a free e-report and a free fertility chart to help you plan and optimize your chances for pregnancy. Thank you.